Meandering along the shoreline of Saguaro Lake in Arizona, the Butcher Jones Trail provides hikers with serene views of the lake's calm waters, stunning scenes of majestic rock formations, desert landscapes, and distant mountain peaks. Follow along as we hike this scenic trail from the Butcher Jones Recreation Site on an early summer morning before the temperatures rise and the crowds flock to the lake. Butcher Jones Recreation Site is located about 44 miles northeast of central Phoenix on the northeast side of Saguaro Lake. Day use passes are required for accessing this recreation site and most sites within Tonto National Forest. Passes cost $8 per vehicle and can be purchased at many retail locations in the area, including convenience stores. The two locations closest to the trailhead are the Chevron Station on Highway 87 in Fort McDowell and the Circle K on Saguaro Boulevard in Fountain Hills. The Butcher Jones Recreation Site lies on the shore of Saguaro Lake, a man-made reservoir created after the Stewart Mountain Dam was built on the Salt River in 1930. Parking fills up quickly during the summer months, so it's recommended to hike early in the morning on weekends. Parking is available near the trailhead along the Butcher Jones Road Loop, and more parking is also available before the loop. The site is open from sunrise to sunset and includes vaulted toilets, picnic tables, and grills, although water is not available. Dogs on leashes are allowed in the recreation site and on the trails. The Butcher Jones Trail is rated as moderate, covering a distance of about 5.8 miles out and back, with an elevation gain of about 266 feet. The first section of trail travels through low-lying areas close to the lake that are surrounded by thick brush so it's recommended to wear insect repellent. Other sections of the trail are fully exposed to the sun with little to no shade, so you'll also want to wear a hat, sunglasses, and plenty of sunscreen. In the early morning hours, the sounds of birds fill the air as the trail meanders through the dense wooded areas. Enjoy these calming early morning sounds from the trail.
Near the end of the trail, hikers have the option of turning northeast or left to walk towards Burrow Cove, or turn southeast or right to access the shoreline. We chose to follow the trail southeast down to the water, where it eventually ends, before turning around and hiking back to the trailhead. Hiking the Butcher Jones Trail covered a distance of about 5.2 miles out and back, gaining 266 feet in elevation. It took us about 2 hours and 20 minutes to complete. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed the sights and sounds of hiking the Butcher Jones Trail. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more trail guides and trip ideas for exploring Arizona.